The China Securities Regulatory Commission has approved an average of 2.1 billion yuan of IPOs each week over the past few weeks. That is down from a weekly average of over 5 billion yuan earlier in the year. Eight companies last week got their IPOs approved. The offerings are worth a total of just 250 million yuan, and that has led to speculation that IPOs would be suspended altogether. If the market falls much more, the CSRC said it would continue its IPO reforms and stay focused on the quality, not quantity, of the companies that go in public. The CSRC will further strengthen IPO controls and regulations to prevent fake earnings numbers, and we won't allow companies to dress up their performances by temporary job cuts and lower salaries. Punishments would be in place if any cases are discovered. Analysts say the CSRC considered the tolerance ability of the markets before implementing the reforms. The analysts also say that the reforms will bring short-term pain to the markets, but will help to build a healthier investment environment over the long term. I think investors should lower their return expectations and look for stable investments. The assets allocation is always important. We do not put all the eggs in one basket. Putting money in different Will get you a stable income and better risk control. Global index provider MSCI will decide on June the 20th whether to add Chinese shares to its key equity benchmarks used by asset managers, which could potentially trigger foreign buying. Meantime, CGTN.